Scott Edwards. Congratulations to Jim Carter. He defeated Wayne Lynch tonight, three straight. Uh, he called you out. He respond to the call out. Uh, he called you out of retirement. Thank you very much. It was a nice victory. Uh, I'm still retired, uh, but I'm obviously training. They that wish you called me out. I told him straight. No mercy, I'll put in the work, train, did a lot of tennis, a lot of fitness drills at home, etc. And I came here and showed the night that I still have it. You can't be serious. I noticed in the first game, you know, your energy level was very high. You wanted to sew him. What went wrong in terms of sew? Well, it was very close. 29, you know, things can go anywhere. The last ball, we played. Let me go close. Everything, but that's how it goes sometimes. So yeah, I checked that and they pushed on to the second year where they keep the same intensity. They got a lead in that one, so it wasn't so easy to start in there. So he got away in 1916. It looked to go the game was over, but never said that. Kept focus, point for point, 1916, 1917, all the way to 21. And that second game gave me confidence to move on to the second game, but because I thought in the second game, your energy level kind of went down, and it was a spot of the game, but during the last latter half of the game, you seem to get a rhythm, you seem to get a, a second win. Yes, definitely. In the second game, I don't know, I lost a little rhythm, but I wasn't sending the ball like I was in the previous game, so I just told myself, okay, you want to keep down, you know, there's nothing to panic or worry about. So I caught my rhythm, momentum into the latter half of the second game, and of course, confidence is important. Right into the third game, and it's easy for you. You know, you know, you came through the juniors, you were very successful in the juniors. But now that you're a senior, you seem to be moving away from tournaments and so on. Is there a reason for that? Yes, definitely. I think that, you know, over the years, tennis hasn't been progressing as fast as I would like it to. I'll put it that way. And I think we should bring some technology into this sport. It's a lovely sport. It needs to move. It's not moving right now. So I encourage anyone who has cameras or willing to help in any way possible to get the cameras into tennis and you definitely see back up on the court training hard coming for titles. Are you talking about like, um Falkai? Yes, Falkai would be perfect. Okay. Too long. I need it. So we're showing tonight some funny calls but at the end of the day we're human and we have to accept this. You know, I'm not blaming anyone for saying bad. But that's what we need that one. That's the only way far from here. Alright, despite you're not playing in Chroma, you're still training, you're still getting, you know, your, your work and so on. Just in case that you know you decide to come back into the arena, you'll be you'll be fit. Yes, definitely. I train not every day. Sometimes I train for say two weeks and then we take a two week trip off in you know, order just get some rest, focus on other things. As you know, I do a lot of other different things. I'm also doing a lot of teaching, math, coaching, chess. So it's not only tennis in my life. So when the time is right, I put in the work and I get results. Yeah, what well, was your take on the fourth quarter? Phenomena is a seven now in Barbados. It's going to be growing and it seems to be getting better. What is your whole thing about it? Yeah, definitely. It's definitely growing. Um, I have the top team for this. He's the one who started it. And it's just fantastic because since COVID came, everything just like down. You know, tennis had no more life to it. Right? So I think this is a, a great way to start before the tournament. Then, uh, just keep going. So you have anyone in mind that you're to follow? Or do you think that someone won the Call you again. If someone call you again, will you respond? Yes, uh, I'm not going to call it anyone, but in the event that someone do decide to call me up then, of course I'll be willing to accept and we'll see you back in court again. Alright, thank you very much, uh, Ivar. Congratulations, Jim Otter, for tonight. You defeated um, Greenlink 3 3. Um, just hope that you continue your game and also I hope that you come back into the competition. We miss you. Okay, thank you very much. Alright, you're welcome. Thank you.